took the tall wandering off to find a branch railway. Twenty earthy came and Caroline was asleep in a parking spot. She woke up when the light from the sun was rising. She remembered she was to leave the Brownwood's house, but she realized something she needed to look out for. It was about being questioned from them. She was about to move out when she saw the Brownwoods out of the house. They were heading for work, as usual, except Pong was not well. He had to stay in bed. She wondered if he would get her. Would he? Of course he would, because when he was told from his parents about them flattening her tires, he too would like to have fun with her. It was not a nice way to treat an old car like her. She only hoped he wouldn't notice when she leaves. When Mr. and Mrs. Brownwood were out of sight, wheel turn by wheel turn, she began moving off the car park spot. But when she did, she noticed some figures. They were friends of Palms. They invite themselves round when Mr. and Mrs. Brownwood were away. He told them they were to pay a game called Hunt the Car. They noticed her and decided to have some fun with her. Hello, they said. We're the junk breakers. We're visiting our friend. Wait here. Will you also will start scrapping you. As they passed her, Caroline was angry. She spit and smoke at them. <coughs> hey! What? What the? They cried. Your parents won't like this when you get home. To get a bath, puppets. Soon you'll be taken to jail. <laughs> Your friend will be upset when he finds out. She drove off. They felt hurt when they were treated badly. When Pong came out, they told him to get his parents. They were friends together and they never cared about what's right and wrong. Caroline went to the country beside the sea. Many bosses surrounded her. This first visit was perfect, but she knew she had to look out for trouble. There was a road. It went into the forest, looking round to see if nobody was about, which there wasn't. She went in the road. It was not small. It was never restored for years. The main road she used was small. It never hurt her tires. She came to an amazing sight. It was a branch railway, which I told you a while back. Everything was a mess. The shed was untidy. There were tracks that were the same as the road, not small. To tell the truth, this railway was made in secret from someone who wasn't a human, but a pony. You know who made it, don't you? Caroline thought she could rest here, but she had to move on because 
Jacqueline, but what was about to be... But she was about to be in for a shock. And would be trapped. 